Surrey talking all about oh, getting yourself into dogdom via puppies, right, Tash? That's right, Dave. Uh, why don't we show everyone the litter first? This is a brat. They're only eight days old here, and this is a litter of Great Danes. And we're going to talk about puppy care and a, a little bit about these puppies a little bit later. But we have been asking our viewers to email us in with any of their puppy or dog questions. And we got an email in from Tina, and she says, Good morning. I have a Shiba Inu, and he scratches a lot. I know he's shedding right now. Could that be the cause? And is there anything I can do to stop the scratching? Because we're coming into spring, mm -hmm. a lot of the time is they're shedding out coat. So a really good bath to blow out all that winter coat is always a good idea that will help stop the scratching. Also, unfortunately, just like with people, this summer all allergies are starting to kick in. So you're going to have to think about potentially cherry blossom trees or something like that could yeah. also be a problem. But I'll give them a bath first. It's a, a little bit of an easier guess. Should you use shampoo? Yeah, dog shampoo, you bet. Okay, so dog shampoo and just kind of brush it and blow it out. Yeah, what you want to do is really get, use hot water, but uh -huh. obviously, you know, yes. correct temperature, and um, really warm them up, because that will open up the hair follicles. Yes. And then you can even use your blow dryer if your dog's used to it, okay. and that will help dry it, and that will also get rid of the coat that needs to come out while you're brushing. What if your dog isn't used to blow dryer? Get them used to it. Usually, if you're using yours in the, sh uh, like in the bathroom, bring the yeah. dog in, because then he sees you using it, and it's not a stressful thing. Yeah. It's always good. Okay, so we have to introduce this litter. You guys have seven puppies. Yes. Um, now, what's interesting is we got to share, share with everyone this morning. We got a bit of a science lesson here this morning because I, I thought they were kind of conceived like, you know, like adults, like humans. But it's a little different. Why do you explain that to us? It's, a it's, bit? Yeah, it is it's a little neat. different. So basically what happens is when your female comes into your season, mm -hmm. she ovulates. Yeah. And then two days after that, then the eggs actually mature enough that they can be receptive. And how many eggs? They can Does release, they tell us they can release up to 200 eggs. <laughs> <laughs> but there has never been a litter with that. No, egg. no, no, no. Of course, you know, the science of it all, it kicks off the unhealthy ones and, you know, it only implants to what the bitch can handle. Yes. What's interesting is the fact that it's not, like, you know, humans, it's kind of one shot, you know, and once the egg and the sperm catch, it, it continues. Yeah. Um, but this one, it could be over two days. Yes, and well, actually even three. Um, for this particular litter, we had uh, three ties, uh -huh. and so, you know, them getting together. And uh, so that's why you'll see that little uh, Vito here, DeVito, is a kitch smaller than the other kids, because these were most likely conceived the first breeding, where DeVito was most likely conceived on the last breeding. So, you know, we never say rent, it's just when they were conceived. <laughs> okay, I'm sure people at home are wondering, have these puppies been adopted? Yes. Okay. The waiting list for all these kids uh, has been about five years long. Uh -huh. <laughs> and uh, so, yeah, they all have homes to go to. Uh, but the thing is, is that, you know, when we're always uh, more than willing to help anybody find a reputable breeder. Okay. And now the eyes aren't even developed yet, or the ears. No, both eyes and ears are still closed. Uh, those will open in 10 to 14 days. Okay. Should we, can we show everyone the ears? Yeah. That's kind of neat. If you lift up the ear flap, you can actually see that they're still sealed. Oh, pretty soon you can hear. <laughs> uh, when we come back, we're going to be feeding these puppies. And also, David City will have your celebrations of the day. Happy 8th.